Sensories out there and as brethren, thanks for joining me again. I'm back with another video, and this time around, we are going to share out our knowledge that is in the Bible, considering the few days, weeks, or months left before the final exam to prepare adequately. And at this particular juncture, we are going to follow up our discussion with the exam based revisions with its basis to be considered in the Bible. Biology of Paper 1 is one of the most important subjects that would make someone to emerge victorious and provide a person was to consider all that is relevant to be done as an action through proper practice to claim self-reliance. So let's see. We are going to discuss three 2020 questions from Paper 1. 2020 questions in Paper 1. Then also discuss a 2019 Paper 1 question. My main intention is not to see how best the view the questions are, but it is just to see how best we can get an idea, provide the same concept to be repeated, especially in the oncoming exam. So let's see. For 2020 question 5, it was talking about food tastes. And the question was, which of the following would produce a purple color when mixed with burette reaction? Being an exam devotee, claiming and wanting, wishing to obtain victory over this year's exam, you are a person who would look out for the most hidden word that would provide the correct meaning. In this case, we have the word direct reaction. Had this word been replaced with IoT solution, the answer would have been scratch. Because the reaction used to test for something in the presence or the absence of something will determine the particular nutrient you are bound to talk about. In this case, if there was iodine solution here, the answer would have been starch. Provided there was, that is to be, that is maybe we talk about Benedict solution, we would have talked about reducing sugar or maybe the fats or lipids. But in this case, we are talking about burette reaction. This necessarily doesn't play any importance, but what is important is the reagent being used to test for the particular nutrient. So the nutrient being tested here for protein. So the correct answer is protein because in the sentence itself there was the word curate reagent, which can be able to produce the purple color or light blue. In this case, the answer is protein. To instance, question 10. The following is the dental formula of a dog. Dental formula simply refers to the arrangement of the different types of teeth in the mouth of a living organism. In this case, we have different types of teeth, the incisors, the canines, and these suitably are made for cutting, the premolars and the molars, these are also precisely made for grinding and crushing of the food particles in the mouth for proper digestion. Then, how many molar teeth are there on the upper jaw of this dog? We are going to ensure and understand that we have two numbers, the numerator and the denominator. So these numbers are representing the jaws. The jaws can be divided into the upper jaw and we can also have the lower jaw. The upper jaw, three, the lower jaw, three. For the canines, one, there is a tooth on the upper jaw and a tooth on the lower jaw. For the premolars, four on the upper jaw, four on the lower jaw. The molars, two on the upper jaw, three on the lower jaw. How many molar teeth are there on the upper jaw of this dog? The teeth that we can be able to talk about from each and every type on the upper jaw are three for the incisors, one for the canines, four for the premolars, two for the molars. Now the question is specific, how many molar teeth are on the upper jaw? So we are only going to focus on the molar and upon focusing on the molar, we are restricted only to pick a number on the upper jaw. So the, number, the answer is two. So this is the correct answer. Provided you don't know anything, you tend to multiply. An examiner is very clever as he is going to put the answer as four and you're going to feel that your choice is right. But the correct answer is C. 29 question 16. Which of the following components is responsible for blood clotting? When we talk about blood clotting, we are going to find that it can only occur once the skin experiences a wound or a damaged tissue. In this case, we have A, erythrocytes, B, lymphocytes, C, phagocytes, D, platelets. When we talk about these names that are here, 
The examiner brought it in a clever way such that they are the other names of what we need to know. The erythrocyte simply refers to the red blood cells. The red blood cells are put in function to transport oxygen to all parts of the body by the help of the hemoglobin. Then, for the lymphocytes and the phagocytes, these are white blood cells. The lymphocytes are able to make sure that they help in the engulfing of the bacteria. The same applies that is to the phagocytes. But we are going to find that the phagocytes have got a lot nucleus, which helps them to engulf bacteria. The lymphocytes are also able to have a large nucleus where they can also help to detoxify some substances by producing and toxins and antibodies. Then, for the platelets, we are going to find that these are the necessary components of blood that can be responsible to just contribute to that is a proper expected blood body. So the correct answer are the platelets. Then, the last question, 2019, question 6. Which of the following deficient diseases results from consuming foods that lack IoT? IoT is an element that can be gotten from table salt. Good example, sodium chloride, which can be used in relish. Now, we have pear, anemia, B, we have goiter, C, we have quashoka, D, we have marasmus. When we talk about anemia, anemia can be in different forms. Here we can have sickle cell anemia. Sickle cell anemia can be as a result of low oxygen concentration in the red blood cells, causing the red blood cell to obtain a sickle cell shape. Then, when we talk about kwashoka, this is experienced as a, a result of the deficiency of, that is, the proteins. Then for marasmus, we can talk about the deficiency of carbohydrates. But when we talk about lack of IoT, we are talking about goiter because IoT is needed for activation of the thyroid gland located along the throat. So the correct answer here is C, goiter. Since there is out there at all, you are going to find this video beneficial and relate it to other exam-based papers and how best you can make victoriously. Remember, believe in yourself always. The beginning is always the hardest. It always seems darkest until dawn. It always seems impossible until it's done. Believe you can do it. Till next time, from now, it's a good time.